Hello guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe down below and also leave this video a like. Um, so this video is basically gonna be on how I gained 20 pounds of muscle since doing the SAS. Um, when I was training for the SAS, I kind of backed off weights. I kind of still did a few weights, but not as much. I was focused on running and body weight movements because my whole idea going into the show was if I could be light, I could be like a marathon runner, like, you know, so I would be able to get through tasks a lot easier than everybody else. Um, looking back, I kind of feel like I should have left, like kept a bit of muscle on, um, just to, it would have helped get through the days a bit better. Cause you know, when you don't weigh much and you're in that type of environments, you know, you lose a lot more muscle quickly. Um, but you know, overall, you know, I got through, you know, most of the tasks pretty easy. Um, so anyway, when I left the show, you know, I lost a lot of weight on the show because we didn't really eat that much. Um, I went back to uni and started training, but my training was more kind of cardio based slash, you know, muscle, but it was more like, you know, endurance training um, for a while. But I was still able to gain weight quickly because muscle memory and also the fact that I was eating a lot more than the show. Um, after a while, you know, I decided to like cut the cardio out because you know, when I was doing cardio, it was all for like, I was gonna do marathons or I was gonna do um, CrossFit. But then I was like, nah, you know, I wanna get back big, you know, big for rugby and stuff. So I started focusing on weight. Um, I increased my calories, you know, cause before the show, you know, I also cut out a lot of calories um, cause I wanted to be built like a marathon running for the show, uh, which is not really ideal for rugby. So, you know, I increased my calories to over 3,000, 3,100 and um, just focused on heavy compound movements, doing sets of 12, uh, down to sets of five to be fair um and just focused on hitting you know uh the muscle heavy um but you know at the same time i was kind of drinking because i was playing rugby so i was going social and drinking beer you know that was affecting me putting weight on um so there was even times where you know i was losing weight there was even times where i wasn't eating because after you you know a night of drinking you, you don't really want to you know you don't want to lift and you certainly don't want to eat but you know i kind of cut all that out in the summer and focused on just building muscle. I rolled my ankle so I couldn't really train legs, but then after a while I could get back into training legs again. So I started hitting a few deadlifts, hitting my squats again, some power movements to help me gain the weight that I needed. Um, so, you know, overall, how I kind of gained the weight was, you know, I just, you know, increased my calories, you know, muscle memory, you know, changed my training from endurance, you know, and marathon running kind of training to the straight bodybuilding training getting back into lifting heavy weights, compound movements, focusing on the muscle, the mind to muscle, you know, movement, which is very important when you're training. You know, there's no point of just fucking lifting a weight and just banging it. You know, you need to make sure your mind's in it, make sure you can feel the muscle tearing down and rebuilding. You know, it's very important that you, you feel, your mind is in your muscle when you're training. You know, also increase your calories. If, you, if you're at a place where you feel you're not gaining any weight, you need to increase your calories. If you're at a place where you're putting on too much fat, you need to decrease your calories. So it's finding that balance. You know, I'm very good at knowing what my body needs when it needs it. For example, the deadlifts, you know, when I when I could train legs again, my legs were lacking. And I'm not a big fan of deadlifts, but I knew to get my legs up quick, adding deadlifts in there is de was definitely gonna help. Squats as well. You know, so I think it's just finding out what works for your body and, and kind of going with it. But you know, that's how I gained over 20 pounds really quickly from doing the SAS. You know, um, I feel like, you know, if anyone's out there trying to gain weight, um, I'll make some videos on how to gain weight quickly, you know, what to eat and how to train. Make sure you give this video a like and also subscribe if you're new to the channel. You gotta you got like the channel for these biceps. I'm gonna, I'm doing how to get big biceps. That's gonna be a video coming soon as well. And um, I'm hitting a diet next year as well because I wanna get shredded, but you know, Thanks for watching and continue to follow me on this journey.